Okay, so this is going to be my first video in a little series on starting from zero in Excel and uh, getting some basic competency. Um, so this is the very beginning. Uh, if you've ever used Excel before, uh, this whole series is not for you. Uh, but if you're brand new to Excel, this is a good place to start. So Excel is a spreadsheet. It looks like this, little squares going across. So you have rows going this way, row one, row two, row three. You have columns going this way, A, B, C. Um, the intersection of a row and a column is called a cell. So here we have cell A1, that's called its address. So this is cell A1, its address is A1. Address of this cell is A2. Uh, address of this cell is B2, it's column B, row 2. These columns go on forever. Uh, uh, you can have hundreds of columns, I believe. The rows, you can have over a million rows. You will virtually never run out of uh, rows or columns as a casual Excel user. Um, so each, each of these is called a worksheet. So every collection of rows and columns is called a worksheet. You can have multiple worksheets in a workbook. So down here we have worksheet lesson 1-1, one, one, worksheet lesson 1-2. So these are different worksheets in the same workbook. And the reason you use Excel, the, the purpose of Excel is it lets you organ store data in an organized way. So I think everyone's probably seen a table before. I think everyone understands what this means. Um, you have, you know, what your what your column is describing. Then you have data of one type in this column, data of another type in this column, data of a third type in this column. And in each row, the data stands together. So, item ID two two three stands for junior mints, of which we have fifteen in stock. Uh, so that's the basics of the very basics of Excel. That's the uh, spreadsheet uh, at its most fundamental core. And stick around for the next lesson, and we'll get a little more into why Excel is so powerful.